Hi guys, Liz here. I'm I'm standing in my experience in Sansa, uh, which I called Namaste. It's it's still a work in progress, but um, I left it open because you know, <laughs> otherwise it will never open. So I'm I'm slowly adding bits to it, and I'm working on um, a vocal track that will introduce into it but for now someone asked me about how I achieve the sky so I'm going to show you so when you go into um, edit mode okay so then you need to look at that box up there you need to go to the scene settings and that brings up that box and um, scene settings on the side now if you see the sky box one that is the one that you need to look at because that has a number of um, set sky boxes in there to give you those those skylights so basically I'll just take you through some of them um, and when you go around Sansa you'll see that um, a lot of these are used and this is this I have to say this is my favorite one which is the um, sort of moonlight one it's actually really beautiful I really like this um, but for Namaste I decided to um, for now um, use the other one that I've got I probably will revert back to this at some stage um, but I'm just taking you through so I, I think the different levels of lighting um, I sort of give you the ambiance of whatever scene you're creating. Um, I like the one I've got because it looks like there are worlds upon worlds going on around you, which is, you know, it's just something that I really liked. Um, but as you can see, I'm just camming around very quickly with my jerky cam. <laughs> it's just really jerky cam. <laughs> so this is the Highland Sky Bus. Have you noticed that my... Um, my aerodrome thing when I'm in um, edit mode it's always in the sky uh, but when I go into full publish mode when you so when you go into my experience you find it on the ground don't ask me I still haven't worked out how to make that that thing there float up in the sky but I eventually will get around to it and um, when I ask someone <laughs> so this is the one I like to use this is the one I've got um, I really like this and so it'll stay for a while um, but yeah so basically you choose the one that you want okay so you go through them and then you choose the one you want and then what you need to do is um, basically you need to save it okay so that saves it as your your work so any work that you do you save it okay so even if you don't publish it straight away it's saved in your settings for when you go back and work more so you don't have to complete everything in one day so it saves and then once it's saved so it's saving 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 once it's saved um, then what you when you've decided that you're happy with everything in your your your, your work you go to publish and so then you publish it and it becomes um, that scene so that when you log on again or anyone comes down to that scene that's the sky that they will see okay so it, it's as simple as that um, it took me a while to work it out and and when I worked it out I was like whoa <laughs> I'm really proud of myself <laughs> but anyhow that's the basics um, how to change your sort of skybox wind light or whatever you want to call it environment and I'm expecting probably in the marketplace they'll probably start to increase environments when in creators coming so you'll be able to purchase um all sorts of environments or, or if you're a creator make one of your your own but um for now i use the ones that are readily available anyhow thank you for watching Bye bye